types of the erosional processes by the river corrosion corrasion attrition and hydraulic action corrosion corrosion is basically nothing but the solution it is the chemical agent it is the chemical action on the soluble on the soluble elements on the soluble elements leading to erosion leading to erosion so the chemical action the chemical action on the soluble elements is called as corrosion if i talk about corrosion c o r r a s i n corrosion isko hum abrasion bhi kehte hain abrasion corrosion also known as abrasion if you talk about so abrasion it takes place in three forms it takes place in the lateral erosion lateral erosion vertical erosion lateral erosion vertical erosion and the headward headward erosion theek hai so three form mein hota hai ye the corrosion takes place via lateral erosion vertical erosion as well as the headward erosion so these are the erosional processes by the river we will see each one of them now we will see one by one so what are the erosional processes by the river corrosion corrosion attrition and the hydraulic action corrosion yani kya corrosion is nothing but solution remember corrosion by corrosion by solution okay solution yaad rakho what when i say solution what do i mean so there are certain elements there are certain rocks which can be dissolved these rocks or the particles they can be dissolved in the river water when they are dissolved they are then eroded so corrosion basically refers to that chemical action it is a chemical action by dissolving the soluble constituents so whatever is the soluble constituent there is a chemical action and then it is dissolved and eroded this is what is corrosion now what is corrosion if i say corrosion this is your corrosion if i move on to explaining corrosion corrosion it is also called as abrasion okay abrasion theek hai corrosion also known as abrasion it is basically when the solid load solid load in the river bears down the other rock theek hai corrosion mein kya ho raha hai so if there is abrasion going on abrasion kon kar raha hai ek rock koi bhi rock koi bhi rock agar ye landform hai ye landform hai yahan river hai इसके अंदर रॉक है ये रॉक अगर इस लैंडफॉर्म को इरोड करे लैंडफॉर्म को इरोड करे बाय फिजिकली वेयरिंग डाउन फिजिकल वेयर डाउन कर रहे हैं दैट इज कॉल्ड एज कोरेजन और दी एवरेजन एंड इट इज ऑफ थ्री टाइप्स द फर्स्ट इज दी डाउन कटिंग और दी वर्टिकल इरोजन वर्टिकल इरोजन ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज दी डाउन कटिंग here what happens here is the the solid load the solid load erodes the the base of the stream the base of the stream leading to down cutting this is vertical erosion if you talk about the lateral erosion the erosion is on the walls of the stream 
the erosion is on the walls of the river so this is your lateral erosion and then we have the headward headward erosion so if i talk about the headward erosion the erosion is at the origin of the stream which causes the origin which causes the origin to move back okay so there are of three type lateral erosion headward erosion what we have seen so far we have seen erosional processes in the erosional processes the first what we saw was the corrosion corrosion is the solution so river water mein jo bhi soluble particles hain jo bhi soluble particles hain wo sab dissolve ho jayenge dissolve ho jayenge can you see anything here no right so everything is dissolved sab kuch itna dissolve ho gaya hai aur erode ho gaya hai to usko hum solution kehte hain theek hai now the second thing that we are talking about is the corrosion corrosion yani kya see you can see this there is this movement there is physical wearing down so this rock is now trying to erode the entire land form it is trying to physically erode the entire land form and it can be of three type it can be vertical erosion okay here vertical erosion vertical erosion hoga ya to fir river jo hai ye river jo hai apne side banks ko erode karegi it will erode the side banks side banks side banks so it will be lateral erosion or the river if this is the river this is the way river is flowing river is flowing river is flowing the river is eroding the origin itself it is eroding the head itself this is called as the headward erosion so corrosion and corrosion is it clear to you see what is happening here is what is happening here is if this is the river if this is the river which is flowing okay now the river is not the river wants to erode this kaise erode karega it can erode it can erode this either by solution process or the corrosion process theek hai ye agar dissolve hone wala hai डिजोल्व हो सकता है तो इरोड हो जाएगा और फिर ये इरोड होने के बाद ये ऐसे जाएगा इरोड होने के बाद ये ऐसे जाएगा दिस इज कोरोजन दूसरा क्या होगा फिजिकली इसको तोड़ दिया फिजिकली इसको तोड़ दिया ठीक है दिस इज कोरेजन कोरेजन अब कैसे कर सकती है रिवर नीचे तोड़ सकती है रिवर साइड में भी तोड़ सकती है ठीक है एक एक कंटिन्यूस इसको आपने पत्थर मारते गए पत्थर मारते गए पत्थर मारते गए तो ये इरोड हो जाएगा विल दिस इरोड हाउ कैन यू इरोड दिस इधर यू कैन इरोड दिस वर्टिकली इधर यू कैन इरोड दिस वर्टिकली और यू कैन ऑल्सो इरोड दिस साइड वे ठीक है सो वेन द रिवर इरोड वर्टिकली इट इज कॉल्ड एज वर्टिकल इरोजन वेन द इरोड साइड में इट इरो इट्स कॉल्ड एज दैटरल इरोजन सो वर्टिकल इरोजन or the lateral erosion now imagine one more thing imagine one more thing this is a river okay this is the origin yahan se river start hui okay this is where the river is flowing now this is the origin can the river erode this way my question to you is if this is the origin river is falling this way falling this way falling this way falling this way river will erode this particle can the river erode this part also this is called as the headward erosion the river is also eroding the above part that you will call as the headward erosion so one is the headward erosion vertical erosion and the lateral erosion so this is your this what we have completed is corrosion corrosion in the corrosion we are talking about lateral erosion vertical erosion and the headward erosion the third type of erosion by the river is the attrition attrition you know what is the word attrition means attrition kya hota hai 
आप बहुत पढ़ लिए पढ़ लिए पढ़ लिए आपने पंद्रह घंटे पढ़ लिया पांच दिन छठे दिन आप गिर जाओगे छठे दिन आप बोलोगे यार आज मन नहीं कर रहा पढ़ने का क्यों क्योंकि एट्रीशन हो गया है अब ना मैं पूरा टूट गया हूं शरीर मेरा पूरा टूट जा रहा है दैट इज एट्रीशन सो वट आई एम ट्राइंग टू से दीज रॉक पार्टिकल्स दे एक्चुअली द रॉक पार्टिकल्स दे ऑल्सो ब्रेक वाइल दे आर मूविंग ओके दे ऑल्सो ब्रेक वाइल दे आर मूविंग दे विल दे विल कोलाइड अगेंस्ट वन अनदर दे विल कोलाइड अगेंस्ट वन अनदर द रॉक पार्टिकल्स दे विल कोलाइड अगेंस्ट वन अनदर एंड दे विल ब्रेक वेन दे ब्रेक दैट इज कॉल्ड एज एट्रीशन ओके एट्रीशन इज द होल पार्टिकल इट इज कोलाइडिंग अगेंस्ट वन अनदर and then it is breaking down into small 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 fragments in the attrition you can write the river river load particles they strike they strike and collide against each other they strike and collide against each other and break down in the process प्रोसेस ठीक है तो दिस इज एट्रीशन इफ आई इफ यू हैव टू स्टडी व्हाट इज हाइड्रोलिक एक्शन ओके सो फर्स्ट राइट व्हाट इज हाइड्रोलिक एक्शन देन आई विल एक्सप्लेन इट इज इट इज मैकेनिकल मैकेनिकल लूजनिंग ऑफ द मटेरियल एंड स्वीपिंग ऑफ material by river water flashes water splashes against the river bank and this integrate the rock okay theek hai attrition is the river particles they strike and collide against each other and they break down in the process they will break down the tune jhagda kiya maine jhagda kiya dono ne jhagda kiya dono break down ho gaye but jhagda kiya theek hai that is attrition in the hydraulic action what is happening here is okay suppose this is the bank this is your river which is flowing this is the river which is flowing and this is the bank this is the bank now this river will also splash out water here it will also splash out water here theek hai if you splash out the water here this will mechanically break down because of the force of the river river ka itna force hai itni bar mara 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 ki ye khud toot gaya theek hai to usko bolte hain hydraulic action mechanical loosening by the of the material and sweeping of the material by the river this water splashed against the river bank so water is splashed against the river bank and then there is disintegration of the rock so there is this disintegration of the rock because the river is also splashing water here